there's work to be done. Your home for the Hoosier Lottery, WTWO. Now, your local weather authority with meteorologist Mallory Jenkins. Welcome back. We are going to start off here with what we are tracking for the next few days. We are looking at that dry weather remaining throughout the day today. The rain won't move in until we get into later tonight into the overnight hours. Cooler temperatures will follow that rain for the weekend, but they won't stick around too long as we'll get back into those mid 60s by next week. Temperatures across the valley right now are anywhere from around 40 degrees in the Crawfordsville area, a little bit warmer to the south. We've got Effingham off to the west at 55. Ben Sins and Robinson are both sitting at 48. We're looking at those winds coming out of the northeast right now at 5 to 10 miles an hour. And moving on to the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, we are all clear across the valley right now that will remain the same throughout the day today until later when we have some rain moving in. Our satellite and radar here, again, we are clear across the valley right now, but looking down here to our south and our east, this uh, rain off that began to develop in Texas is beginning to move to the north and the east uh, toward our direction. So we'll see that moving in as we go into uh, the evening hours tonight. Looking at our seven day precipitation forecast, we are looking at those mostly cloudy skies sticking around through the day today. Rain will move in late tonight into the early morning hours tomorrow. We are looking at a widespread rain event through the overnight. May see a brief break of that rain through the afternoon tomorrow. Um, and then another section of rain moves in late in the day on Friday. This part of the system could have some um, more energy with it, more, some more convective energy, some rumbles of thunder, heavier bouts of rain. Um, nothing severe that we are tracking, anything severe is well to our south, but again, we could have just a few embedded thunderstorms in that. And then following that, the clouds will clear out for the rest of the weekend. We will remain uh, clear through Sunday and into the start of the work week, and those warmer temperatures will return as we get to Monday. So for today, we are looking at those temperatures hitting a high of 57 degrees, cloudy skies, winds out of the southeast at 7 miles an hour. Going into the overnight tonight, temperatures will fall to about 48 degrees. We have that rain moving and late tonight into the early morning hours tomorrow. Again, this will be a widespread rain event through the day tomorrow. Temperatures will hit around 65 for the day tomorrow. And then going into the weekend, temperatures cool for the day on Saturday as that rain moves out in the afternoon. Sunday, we're looking at sunny skies. Cool temperatures remain through Sunday, but by Monday, we are looking at sunny skies and the temperatures returning back into the 60s. It would be nice to see that sun return uh, after a few dreary yes. days that we've